Hey, so I want to talk quickly about the new titles that have started trickling in at the 1st of July. Um, the first one is we have new cloth books that um, came out. These ones, unlike the other ones, have no crinkle paper in them, which is sometimes nice for when you want your child to be a little bit quieter. So uh, they have two of these. There's one about um, good night and good morning. This one is about colors, the, f the f uh, penguins flip, um, uh, wings flap, sorry, <laughs> couldn't think of that word. Anyway, um, so this one goes through the colors of the different animals. Um, and then it has this hard handle with the beads moving. Great for teething babies. Um, super fun. My daughter loves this. Um, next we have our uh, daily routine books. This one is how to brush your teeth with snappy crop. We have one that is um, getting your cheeky monkey to eat, um, bathing your lion, and um, the other one is getting your, um, I can't remember what animal it is, but it talks about bedtimes. So um, this one just talks about how to brush your teeth, why we brush our teeth. Um, it's board book, so it's durable, and it's nice and slick, so it's easy to clean off. Um, kids love talking about their daily routine, so they're going to love these books. Um, next we have uh, our very popular Shine a Light books. We have two new, two new Shine a Light books. This one is of the human body. Um, the other one is Animal Camouflage. So for those of you who are unfamiliar with how uh, Shine a Light books um, are, I'll try and show you. I don't know if it's dark enough. So anyway, uh, these books are fantastic. It talks about... Um, it asks if we can see the baby growing in her tummy. So you put a flashlight behind the page and you can see the little baby growing in her tummy. That's what our shine a light books are. Is you shine a flashlight behind the page and then it shows the secrets behind it and then on the back it's black and white and it shows a little bit of facts about what it is you're showing. The other one is um, is uh, camouflaged animals so that makes 11 books in the shine light books um, next we have our um, our game pad our travel game pad we have these in white clean um, cards but this one is our pad <clears throat> and so they're just different activities that kids can do in the car on long trips since it's summer and vacations are starting um, different like spotting books um, they can be ripped out of this it's just nice and easy to travel and then we have um, <clears throat> so we have these press out paper dolls who remembers playing with paper doll books these ones are awesome so it has a fold out and it's got the bedroom and the last page is part of that so this book, the pages can be ripped out, and you've got different dolls that you can use. I think there's four of them, yeah, four dolls that you can use. And it's got hangers that you can hang the clothes on. Different styles for evening wear and sunny days. And these, um, instead of having the dresses and stuff, fold around the doll. They've got little slots in the doll for the for the uh, clothes to fit um, easier. So that's our press out paper dolls. <clears throat> we also have um, new uh, sticker books. This is one of them. It's about fashion and for those who have children that um, are into fashion design this book is excellent for that. So we have um, it really encourages your child to look at little swatches and matching different things and so you have your your dolls in the different scenarios and then back here you have the, the um, stickers that you can do. Uh, you can color on the hats which is nice. You can draw different designs on the on the dresses and the different fashion stuff. 
you've got different swatches that you can use. It really encourages the child to be creative and to um, use their own imagination with this. So there's that. Um, we also have a new uh, book. This is Cordelia. This one is oh, one of my favorites. If you are familiar with Jonathan James and the What If Monster, this is the same author. Um, it also comes with a plush toy of Cordelia here. Uh, this is just a story about um, this little girl who believes that she can fly and she goes ev anywhere she wants to and then her friends start telling her that she can't fly and she starts believing them. And then at the end she realizes that she was much happier believing what she wanted to believe. And so she goes back to um, believing she can fly and it's just all about gaining confidence in yourself and um, believing in who you are. I love it. Um, then we have our Start to Cookbook. This is excellent. This book, oh, I'm so excited about it. Um, so these books have, it's got step-by-step uh, -step instructions with um, a text as, long as, as well as pictures to kind of help uh, your child learn. These recipes are fun. They, I'm excited to try some of them. They're, um, it talks about different kinds of noodles and if you want to make your own noodles, you can make those. Um, it's got different tabs for the different types of food. It's so much fun. It's a spiral back, which we all love in our cookbooks. Um, so this, we also have um, new chapter books and this is not, there's so much more, but this is the only one that I have. We have um, so many. This is like so many more books than what I have here, but this is all that I have right now. Um, my, my books haven't come in yet. So this is about, um, I'm going to read the back. It says, when Amelia's parents decide to reopen a creepy old hotel, Amelia and her friend Charlie quickly discover that the place is much more than it seems. Uh, the Gateway is no ordinary hotel, and its guests aren't just visiting from other cities and towns. So it's a mystery book. The text is quite large, and so um, it's got some pictures, but not a lot, so probably maybe third grade level. Anyway, mystery books, uh, fun, fun, fun book. So anyway, th again, these are just the books that I have. Um, there are a lot more chapter books, a lot more kids books, um, a lot more noisy books. There's more, um, there's another that's not my book. It's that's not my badger. Um, we've got more um, classic books. We've got a um, Anne of Green Gables um, abridged book. We have a Little Red Riding, another Little Red Riding book. We have, oh my goodness, we have just so many more sticker books, so many more activity books. We have Astronaut Academy books. So many. Um, but this is just a little rundown of what I have. So stay tuned and I'll show you some more that I don't have.